Hi, I'm Liz. You've already worked through with me how to work out the surface area and volume of a square or rectangular tank. Now we're going to have a go at working it out if we've got a circular tank. That might be a clarifier, might be a reservoir, you might even want to work out the cross-sectional area of a pipe. So how are we going to do it? First of all we need to understand a few maths concepts. One of them is pi. We're going to use that in our calculations. I'm going to use the simplified version, 3.14. Now pi doesn't have any units. We're also going to need to know either the diameter or the radius. The diameter is the length right across the fattest part of the circle, as if you'd folded it in half. Half of that is the radius. That's as if you'd just taken a point smack dead centre and drawn a line out to the edge of the circle. There's two ways of doing the calculation. You can either use the diameter or the radius in your calculation. I find the diameter version gets a bit confusing when we start getting into the squared version because you've got to remember to do division as well. So let's not do that. Let's just keep it nice and simple and work with our radius. So in this case, the radius of our tank is 3 metres. So, how do we work out the surface area? We just have pi times the radius squared. So the radius squared is just the radius times itself. Remember to write your units in when you're doing this, and remember that we're going to end up with square metres. So we've got 3.14 for pi times our radius, which was 3 metres, times our radius again, 3 metres again. Now you guys would be doing this with a calculator, but I'm going to dazzle you with my math skills. I'm going to end up with an answer of 28.26 square metres. If you're out on site, you could actually paste this out if you haven't got a tape measure with you. And to give you a really easy mental way to check your answer, think about that circle being inside a square. If you had 6 metres by 6 metres, you'd get 36 square metres. So you know straight away your answer should be less than that, because you're not including the pointy bits. <laughs>